Mm. Pretty little black skin girl, pretty little diamond ring. Oh, Caribbean beauty, Caribbean cutie. Hey gems, welcome back to my channel. So I decided to record a video showing you guys what I eat in a day. Um, now that I'm pregnant and of course still vegan. Uh, not to mislead anyone, but I have not been eating like this since the beginning of my pregnancy. I actually just started eating like this. I was actually eating pretty reckless at the beginning. Well, reckless in my opinion. Um, just eating a lot of wraps and fried stuff and bread and stuff like that not enough fruits so i now that i feel a little better in terms of morning sickness and so forth i'm trying to incorporate way more fruits into my diet and veggies like salads and stuff uh, tummy yummy in the tummy yummy <laughs> Is that again? Yummy in the tummy. Yummy tummy. <laughs> no. No what? No, 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 no. Give me a kiss? No. Can I have a kiss? Mm. Mm hmm. So like I was saying, um, the beginning of my pregnancy, I was not eating as healthy as I know I should have been. Not saying that I wasn't eating fruits and veggies I just wasn't eating as much as I know I needed to I had all kind of weird cravings and um, I was just giving in to all of them <laughs> so after about the first few weeks I started and my morning sickness came down harder what I what I wanted to eat was limited, but what I could eat was limited. And the only thing that seemed to stay down in the morning was oats. So for like months, I've been eating oats for breakfast. However, this week I haven't. I haven't been eating oats, which is good. Um, not saying that oats is unhealthy, it's just that too much of anything is not good for you. And like I said, I've been eating it every day for months including this guy because <laughs> he eat what i eat basically so um we switched things up and we're on a more healthier path especially around this time with the virus going on you want to eat as much fruits and veggies as possible keep your immune system up and all that good stuff so follow me today and see what i eat in a day every day is not the same so don't think that this is what i eat every day but um you know, I kind of been eating like this for the week, so we'll see what the, the day brings us. Anyways, let me show you guys how I start my morning. So for the past couple weeks, I've been starting my morning with a herbal tea. Um, I usually do lavender and chamomile, but today I have nettle and dandelion. So I'm just going to strain this into my cup with a teaspoon of honey. Baba gone. So I have my tea strained and I like to add a teaspoon of sea moss gel. Since I don't like the taste of the sea moss by itself, I find that putting it in my tea helps. So if I could get this open. I just stir that around until it dissolves and I sip on my tea. I'm just gonna sit here, sip on my tea until it's done, and then I'm gonna show you guys my breakfast. Nettle tea, dandelion, raspberry, um, what else? Olive, olive leaves. Those are really great teas to drink while you're pregnant. If you're looking for healthy herbal teas, that is pregnancy safe, those are just a few you can start with. Melon. Melon, yeah. Okay, so I'm finished with my tea, which was really good. Um, now let me show you what my breakfast is. So I already had this prepared and sitting in the fridge, a bowl of melon. So I have watermelon, it's mostly watermelon. And then I have some honeydew and cantaloupe and 
Isaiah is eating melon. This is his second bowl. <laughs> come, come, let me help you. Hmm. He's so used to eating oats in the morning that every morning he wake up and ask for that. And I'm trying to break him out of it and incorporate more fruits. Not saying that he didn't eat fruits, but it's been hard to get him to eat fruits. So yeah, this is what we're doing. He's okay. been eating he's been eating fruits for breakfast all week. Um here. So I'm gonna sit and enjoy my breakfast. And I'm pretty much going to be eating fruits from now until about lunchtime. And I usually have like a late lunch. So I'm going to eat these melons. And then probably in the next 30 minutes to an hour, I might have like a few pears and a peach. Yeah, like I've been doing really good with fruits and I feel so much better. So I'm going to keep this going. Shout out to um the hubby for packing up our house with fruits like one day he came home with so much fruits two watermelons two cantaloupe two honeydew and then like a bunch of pears and oranges and peach i've already ate like most of the peach he brought home we have pears plums yeah so I'm going to sit and enjoy this and then I'll show you guys the different fruits I eat throughout the day, what I eat for lunch, and what I eat for dinner. Real quick, I just wanted to show you guys the teas that I usually start my day off with. I have dandelion, my nettle leaf, red raspberry, then I have chamomile, which these are organic as well. I just put them in, I had them longer, so I put them in a mason jar. And I have lavender so that's the teas that I've been drinking and probably will continue to drink throughout my pregnancy and beyond <laughs> I'm about to eat a snack which is just some pears cut up in four it's about two pears um, I'm gonna give Josiah oh, some more. you want more here Bite it. Good job. So I am feeling a little hungry and need another snack. So I'm going to have me some toast. <clears throat> Just gonna toast two slices of this multi-grain bread and have it with some Brazil nut cheese that I made um, in this bowl. I usually have my toast with avocado, but I don't have any avocado. I ran out a few days ago. So here is my toast. I have three slices of bread and this is the cheese. I know it does not look appealing, but it tastes so good. And yeah, nothing fancy y'all. Like I'm not a fancy eater. I just eat what I like. <laughs> So it's just about dinner time and um, I'm about to prepare my dinner. Josiah is going to have some kamut cereal, which I made already. And if you don't know what kamut is, well, what kamut cereal is, it's kind of like cream of wheat, but you use the kamut grain instead. Um, you buy it in like a grain that looks like rice and then you grind it up to like a grainy powder and then you make the cereal like how you would make cream of wheat. Well, everybody don't make cream of wheat the same, but if you're from the islands, how you make cream of wheat. Um, yeah, so he gonna have that for dinner. It's hot, so I'm just letting it cool before I bring him over. And I am going to have a kale salad wrap. Y'all, I know what I eat throughout the day is boring, but Listen, my eating habits changes throughout my pregnancy and I just happen to record when it's not that interesting, but healthy. So that's a good thing. So I'm going to 
make a nice kill salad and then I'm gonna roll out three wraps using some leftover dough and I'm gonna have me a kill salad wrap I'll show you guys how that look when it's finished this is not a tutorial video so I'm not showing you how I make anything but if that's what you want to see let me know so this is the last meal of the day um, well the last thing I'll be eating today and if I have anything else later, it'll probably be another cup of tea or um, some juice. I have some fresh squeezed juice in the fridge. Um, well, leftover juice. This one is a pineapple, ginger, and turmeric. And this one is just orange and ginger. So. I basically drank most of this yesterday as you can see but I might finish this later if I have anything else so yeah I'll show you guys how my wraps look when I'm finished so stay tuned just finished feeding Josiah his kamut and I was taking him out of his high chair the empty bowl was on his little table there. I'm pulling out the table a little bit so I can take him out. And the thing slipped my hand and the bowl dropped and shattered. So I just finished, well, I'm not finished preparing my dinner, but um, I'm finished preparing the gist of it. You see the potty? Saya, do you need to use the potty? I don't even remember what I was saying, but I had to book deal with that. Anyways, um, I'm about to put my wraps together, sit down and eat. I've had so many distractions. It's just me and Desayo home today, so I am eating way later than I usually eat, and I'm starting to feel gassy and nauseous. Um, I'm so tired. Anyways. This is my kale salad. If you want to know how I make my kale salad, I have a video of that on my channel already. So go check that out. And these are my wraps. These wraps are perfection, y'all. Like, they're nice and soft and flexible. And they smell good. <laughs> so I'm going to use... Um, what am I going to use? What am I going to... I'm going to use a little vegan aids, Put on my wrap. Fill it with the kale salad and then eat. Nothing special. Um, I could have added more stuff, but I'm honestly like, when I'm pregnant, I don't want to cook. When I'm pregnant, I don't want to cook. I don't want to smell the food cooking. I just want to eat. <laughs> so I have not been the one cooking in my household. Um, Jamal cooks. I would assist the most, but he mainly does all the cooking. So I know today has been a boring day, but today I've been home alone, so I'm just eating what has like the least preparation. And um, maybe I'll do another one of these when he actually cooks a meal and you know it's more interesting. I don't know. We'll see. But I'm gonna put these together, show you guys how it look, and then end this video. Nothing special. So here are my wraps. Very simple, literally just have kill salad in it. As you can see, that's all I used. And that's it. That's about it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed. If you guys want to learn, well, if you want me to do a video on how I make my wraps from scratch, give this video a thumbs up. I actually, I have a video recorded um, showing how I make my wraps already. It's just not edited. So it's very old though. It's very old. You guys wouldn't even believe how old the video is. If I told you. <laughs> I think I recorded it in like 2018. <laughs> Shortly after having Josiah. So um, I'm going to look at it. And if it's okay, I might still edit it and put it up. But if not, I might record a new one and then um, edit that and put it up. But yeah, if you want to know how I make my kale salad, I have a video of that on my channel already. And that's it. I'm about to sit down, eat, clean up, and then get
get Josiah and myself ready for bed. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. It costs you nothing. It means the world to me. And yeah, you guys will see me in my next video. Peace. And you deserve it all. This is perfect. And it's the magic and everything you do. Isn't that nerd?